this project wasn't necessarily one that was planned or expected, but um, we were the one that answered the phone um, early in the morning. The fire happened at 1 o'clock a.m. on a Friday night. So I made emergency calls to Newman Brothers, contractors, their subcontractors, and plus some remediation, catastrophic damage fire control people to come in to help with the water remediation uh, to try to move things out of the way to eliminate as much damage as we could. The project scope is it ended up kind of in three different phases. Uh, the first phase was the initial fire recovery, so stabilization of the buildings. We had glass falling off of both of EMC's buildings. We had to go in, hang guys off of cranes, and actually take all the glass from the outside off with hammers most of the time. Um, behind that we had to infill those where the glass was removed um, with um, temporary panels. Uh, the second phase was the interior replacement, so we were actually replacing the glass. And then the third phase was some work on the outside um, and also some of the interior finishes that were restored after the fire. The first logistical problem was just how to get the uh, openings that were completely breached due to uh, glass breakage uh, enclosed and then what do you do to develop safety for the occupants of the building on the glass that uh, was not completely broken out uh, but was broken uh, and still in the openings. The whole project was a challenge. It was uh, where you're essentially sitting uh, or, or sleeping and, and you're awakened into this uh, monstrosity that no one really understood the scope or, or what best to do. Um, ultimately a lot of times we like to work in areas where we can plan work and then work the plan. Um, that wasn't the case on this project, so right away we were um, against the odds, really just trying to understand what was the most critical component, um, getting the manpower and personnel on site to do that, and then execute the work. In this particular situation, it was an emergency. Everything that we did was uh, the first time, and it was with uh, very little planning, however with a lot of synergy from the EMC uh, facilities management team, and the expertise of Newman Brothers. And Newman Brothers, I want to thank most of all the people that repaired the glass, that worked all hours, uh, night and day, to make EMC whole. Uh, I really deeply appreciate it from my heart. A facility director is only as good as the resources that he can call. People that answer their phone at one o'clock in the morning are invaluable to me.